Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, as the title suggests, uh, we're going to run through how to tie two types of knots. They're pretty simple to tie, so good for beginners. Um, they're the knots that I use on probably 90% of my rigs tying. Uh, so the first one is the uni knot, which out of the three knots is the one I use most. So it's a, again, it's a simple knot to tie. So all you need to do is pass your line through the eye of the hook, bring the tag end back up, probably about three, four, five inches, something along them lines. Then you're going to double back on yourself and make a loop against the main line there. Then you're going to take the tag end and you're going to wrap around the main line and the loop you've made. I'm going to go three times on this because it's quite a strong line. It's a 60, 70 pounds breaking strain. So the thicker the line you have, the less loops you need to do. If it was a thinner line, I'd probably wrap around five or six times. When you've got that to that stage, you're going to bring the tag end upwards to start forming the knot at the top. Then at this stage, you want to wet your knot um, just to stop or minimize line burn. You can't always stop it, but it should minimize it. So now we're going to wet the knot and then we're going to, using the main line, and the hook we're just going to cinch it together to pull that down and when you get close to the bottom now we're going to pull the tag end just to tighten that coil a little bit more and then finish it off with a good hard tug to cinch it together and then you'll be left with that so you've got a line your main line going inwards and your tag end coming out the top and when you have that, you can just simply trim the tag end so you have this completed knot. I'll try and get a close up on that. You see how tight the coils are on that. And the advantage of this knot on a hook is if you're threading a worm bait up, there's no tag coming out the side that makes it a bit fiddly so when you've threaded it up through there that little tag end as well tiny bit there will stop the worm sliding back down the hook that's the first knot the uni knot really simple and that's the one that I use on most of my rigs okay for the second uh, knot on this video is the half blood knot it is the actual first knot that I was taught by my uncle um, really this is probably the most simple knot you'll tie a lot of people already know this knot but this is for beginners so it's the half blood knot and you start by threading your line through the eye you come back up you don't need as much, much tag in for this one two three inches Thicker line again, so I'm going to do four turns around the main line, and then you come back through the bottom loop you created, and then you need to moisten the line again, and then at that point you can just cinch it all down to the bottom. Do this quite slowly, it does help reduce line burn. And then when you've finished, you should have something like that. Again, tightly coiled. The tag end coming out the side this time as opposed to running up the line. And then just trim off. You always want to leave just a slight bit, a slight tag there. If you cut it too close, there's a chance it could just pop out the bottom. But that's not going anywhere. 
and that's the half blood knot. Okay guys, so that's the two knots completed. Leave a comment in the video if you um, have a different knot you prefer or which one of these two knots you would prefer to use. Thanks for watching guys and I will see you on the next video.